Yeah, all right. I'm pretty excited, eh? What'd they say? But I think we can make it. I'm like smelly hyperventilating. I'm pretty excited, eh? What'd they say? So, there's a fee. So it's $30 to camp, mm -hmm. $20 to get a key. So the reason you've got to come to the roadhouse to get the key is so then they can limit the numbers. So it's not a secret. So it's not so much a secret. So I think I'm going to tell you guys how to how to get here. We're at Dune Dune Roadhouse, right? I so, feel like this is a big deal. Yeah, Dune Dune Roadhouse. Um, and then you ask for the keys to Harry's Hole. So Harry's the owner of the land. It's a, it's a cattle company. The money goes to them. Um, and then they give you a sheet here which tells you how to get to it. Mm -hmm. You don't want to take the wrong turn into one of the creeks. So Why? you said, on the way out, stick left. Because if you stick right, uh, the crossing looks similar to the other one, but it's five metres deep. There's also crocs in the area. Yeah, I don't think it's crocs there. There's swimming holes. So he said, so it says here, slow drive, soft dirt. Uh, you will, yeah, most four wheel drives will kind of make it most here, that. Um, but yeah. This is the direction, so do we need anything from here before we go? I think I need maybe uh, fuel. Fuel, uh, we don't have a whole heap of food. No, no, that's not too bad. Do. So it's 15 k's from here, mm -hmm. and then it's 15 k's in. Great. So we've got 30 k's, so I've got plenty of fuel for that. So we'll head out there. Um, we're excited to show you this joint because we didn't know Buddy existed. I've actually got butterflies right now. Oh, well, yeah, yeah, I'm really excited. So they give you a permit, they give you everything. So this is like, I'm just like, it, it's exciting because it's really well thought out. Yeah, they've done well. And the best thing is, if you rock up and they say, sorry, there's too many people out there, you don't get a key and you can't get in. So I'm feeling really lucky right now that, you know, we've rocked up and there's a key for us. It's meant to be. Mm. Information sheet. And this is the information that you need for Harry's Hole. So it's approximately 15 kilometres from Kananara, the side of Dune Dune. The gate is visible from the road on the right-hand side and has an old sign left-hand side of the gate. You might have to jiggle the lock and the key to open it as it gets pretty hard from time to time because people are trying to get through and not wanting to pay. The drive-in is about 15 kilometres um, and it takes about one hour. They're saying for you to drive really slowly um, and there's some soft dirt so you definitely need a four-wheel drive to do this track. <laughs> um, if you come across any water they advise that you walk it first it's obviously for your own peace of mind, but apparently there's a deep spot of water towards the end of the track. Um, and it follows up cars. So we 100% need to be getting out and checking the depth of the water. Uh, they said that you'll see where other vehicles have gone around this bit of water, so it'll be pretty clear. Uh, no rubbish bins provided, so as per usual, always clean up after yourself. And that's about it. The rest is up to us. What, I'm, what I got from that is that we're going to have to walk them. I normally don't, I just go, yeah, anyway, and yeah. drive through. But I will be walking all the crossings. No, Maxine will be walking all the crossings. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you are. You're walking them. <laughs> but this might be it here. You can eat, nearly, you can, you can miss it pretty easy. What it does is when you're leaving Dune Dune, about 15 k's out, you get this big sweeping left hand bend, and it's the first thing on your right. You'll see it. It's an old gate. We're gonna, I'm just doing a Yui now. Jiggle, jiggle. Getting jiggle with it. Alright. Go jiggle that gate. Well, we don't know if this is the gate oh. for sure. Oh, yeah. oh, yes. This is exciting. Will the key fit? This is the gate. 
Oh, you're that excited, aren't you? I'm so excited. Aren't you? It's a little game. It's not a game at all. So because we're letting our tyres down so much, um, we use these, you can get them from Strawn, but these are like the Camp Boss ones. We're not endorsed by them or anything, but they're cool, because what I like about them is they're adjustable. So you can you can set it to where you want. So there's 15 PSI. You tighten it up. Screw it on. Let's pull that. That's it. They'll let it down to 15 psi. Like it's way easier than sitting there waiting and watching a game. We used to do the whole thing where you get a stick and you count. <laughs> oh, mate. I'd say, wait, well, Max, count to 100. And then I just sit there and he's and then like, she'd be counting. I'm like, no, just a little bit slower. No, and he'd be like, are you still counting? And then you forget, and yeah. then they're not even. Yeah. So this makes sure it's all done properly. Yep. probably does get used a little bit. Um, it's quite corrugated so far on the way in. You can probably hear it. It's very loud. <laughs> and my sway bar is broken, which is making it even louder. But it's quite good. We're in a little bit of a sandy spot now, but it's nothing like the last little secret spot we're in. Oh, no. Like you said, you can definitely tell that it's it's regularly used. Yeah. It's, um, there's, not, there's not trees in the middle of the road. <laughs> no, there's no like, trees coming. Like, you're not running over trees to get there. So far, so far. Kind of feels like you're in, like on a safari in the middle of Africa. <laughs> like, and, and Max, I'm putting, I'm going to tell you right now, we will drive across Africa one day. One day. One day. One day, my love. One day we will, and this is what it's going to look like. Oh my God, here we go. Oh, what's coming up here? It looks like a little yeah. crossing. It's getting a bit more rocky. Woo, she's steep. It looks like we've got a creek just down over here, which looks to be dry. I wonder where the, the creek is that is going to be quite deep. No, this is, oh, this, this is soft is sand. sand. So I've hopped out. The sand is very soft. Carsten's had a few challenges in the past with uh, soft sand like this. He goes gun ho and we've been bogged before. So fingers crossed he can make it cro across. <laughs> Here he goes. <laughs> Too easy. Touch wood, we haven't had any issues with soft sand. It's making us really excited for all the deserts that we want to be crossing. I don't know if you'd get a uh... JK silver line down here. Hey Chris, -o. Is it, it's a challenge my friend, it's a challenge. Oh, here we are, more soft sand. Okay, here we go. This looks like what would normally be a creek. I gotta get up that. What? Up here. What do you mean? That, oh. that rocky friggin' cliff looking thing, I've gotta get up that. 
It doesn't even look like a track. It is, you've got to get up that. Yeah, I know. Where but it's you can like... see where four drives have done skiddies on the rock. Um... And then you take a right that goes up there. Um... I'm guessing you want me to hop out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it was great. Piece of cake. Combi did so well. Yeah, just crawled up. <sighs> Let's continue. Uh, so 15k, I can see why it takes an, an hour, hour. they said. To do 15k. Yeah, because well, they said would, take it slow. Okay, that there would be the t that back there would be the spot that I'd say probably wouldn't get. Caravan. caravan that's too big. Like this, oh god, these are quite, this is quite rocky. Oh, these are awesome. You like big, big boulders. Oh my god, holy shit. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh, this is slow. You could pretty much get out and walk faster than this, eh? Hey? Like you could dead set walk faster than how fast we're having to go. There's this massive basketball, basketball sized rocks. This is completely different to the first track we did out to that other little secret spot. It really is. You know what I mean? There was no rocks like this at all anywhere. Which is making it really enjoyable because this is constantly changing. Love the other track, but love this one too. That's very like bungle bungly lost city looking over there, isn't it? That's, very beautiful. Oh I'm excited God. to see what the waterhole looks like at this one too. It's quite hot today, so it'd be nice for a swim. Well, we had the fan, but it let you. Oh! Oh. I don't know. I, I just got this watch given to me by a friend, and it just vibrated and it said goal. What does that mean? Oh, it thinks all the bumps and corrugations on this road, it thinks you're walking. So it's a ch <laughs> you're cheating. <laughs> You bloody cheat. It's my goal. I need to put it out there. We're gonna get we're gonna get fit again, aren't we? Yeah, ten thousand corrugations. <laughs> that doesn't count. <laughs> This is a 360 view where we are. This is amazing, hey. Like this is some beautiful driving. Even if, mm. even if you were to like leave your caravan at Dun Dun and just do this as a day trip. Agree. You know? Worth it. Just unhitch, take your four wheel drive mm -hmm. and just go and experience this beautiful part of the country out here. Like this is amazing. Like, and the funny oh, thing is, sure. you just drive past it on the main highway. You wouldn't even know it was here. Yeah, you're right, you wouldn't. Okay, hang on, hang on. Down, down 
means we're going to come up this tomorrow. Well, That's it. It's just big rocks. Oh, Jesus. Tomorrow we're going to climb up this. Oh. Felt like the wheel was just off then. It was. It's been lifting. It. So I've got power steering, so I'm getting thrown around here. <laughs> Look at the muscles sticking yeah, out. <laughs> Full flexing. Oh, I gotta... But see, the thing is, I've got to go up this tomorrow. So yeah. I'll be helping out as per yeah. usual. Yeah. Like they're, they're not sharp rocks. They're um they're they're very rounded, so it's not you don't have to worry about getting punctures as such. It's more you know suspension damage and you know maybe CV problems if I am going up. But I've I've got a broken sway bar too. Oh, that was I'm sweating. Like my hands are sweating. So we've been driving now for. Feels like forever. I reckon about 45 minutes. Just slow going, first gear, just creeping. Barely any accelerator. It's just so rocky. But we've just gotten into this little spot around here, and it's 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 a lot greener. So mm. I think we're getting closer to our destination, and still we've seen no water. Yeah, no water at all. It's been very dry. We have passed a lot of um, dried creek beds, so maybe maybe they get a bit more water in them. Um, I put them up on you know, my closer to the wet season. This looks like we are coming closer to what seems to be some sort of water. Uh, yeah, that is water. Well, yep. Oh man, you're walking that, look. What? You're in, baby. <laughs> nah. Yeah, yeah. All right, nah. so uh, like Maxine said that she'd walk them all. I didn't say I'm that. I'm gonna show you this, this is. This is pretty, this I is pretty sick. I did not say that. <laughs> Look. <laughs> you don't even know where it goes. Come on. I'll walk it. You're not walking through that whole thing. You can see someone's come through here today though, Max. This is all freshly like wet, but oh my. Yeah, I'll do it for you. This is so sketchy, like. Oh my God. Are you serious? Oh. It's pretty deep, like, it's got. All right, we're getting up to my knees. We're close. I'm happy to go through at that depth. Huh? This is so crocky. Not an eye. There's got to be another way around it. That's the depth there. So we're up to like my bodies. Um. Big tree there. So if we do, if it does conk out here in the middle, I don't think it will. I think it's gonna push through. We'll get a bit of a bow wave at the front. And then we've got to get up this which it looks like somebody's done recently. And then, you know, I don't want to go through this just to fucking have to go through another one. I literally just ran a bit further and then you get to this. Not bad, not bad. Oh, There's no way. 
This is a stitch up. He said a creek crossing, not drive through a friggin' river. I'm a risk taker, but I think this is a bit too risky. If we had someone else with us, 100%, you could just hook up a snatchy and just skull drag me through. I'd let it dry out overnight and it'd be sweet as, but we're literally out here by ourselves. It looks like someone has come through today, but we don't know if they've left today or got here. Like I'm up to my knees in this section. And it's, um, rocky, it's a rocky bottom. Huh? Look where it came up to. Oh. Yeah, that's, if I stand next to the car. We're not doing that. There's no way, we are not going through that. No. If I stand next to the car, that is no, no, just no. up to the bumper. That, it's just, that's below the, Did we take a wrong turn? There are no turns. I'm torn. What do we do? We're not go through there. We're no? Not, we're not going through there. You sure? A hundred percent sure. If that was up to your knee, like just below your knee, I would say yes. That's too high. That's up to your board shorts. Over your board shorts. Yeah. No. I think we can make it. Um, you seem very unsure and usually when Carsten's confident, I'm confident. There's yeah. a chance that we may not make it. There's a chance that the engine may stop and get flooded with water. Because there are other cars, like, if someone came up behind us, it'd be so sick. It'd be heaps better. I'd feel way more com comfortable. But... So I'll get the winch ready. So if, um, if we do get stuck, I can at least winch myself out into the spot and let everything dry out. Just in case. Um, and I can just grab that, run it out to wherever, and then I don't need to worry as much. I'm feeling nervous. I'm oh, wow. so nervous. Look, you're nervous. How do you think I feel? Oh, no. I anyway, like hey Zuri, Zuri, shh, shh. Quiet, quiet. You're gonna watch it for crocodiles. Oh my god. What part do you want me to film? I don't know, to be honest. Okay, okay, you, I'll get, hang on one second. One second. Just, uh, maybe put your hand out the window. Yep, or hang something. on, I'm just gonna get this for Zuzu so she can look. There you go. like way too easy. We were like a boat. That was great. Water came in, in here. Like, we've got water everywhere. My heart was racing. A lot of water was there. Now we just got to get up this little step up, which is going to be interesting. Do you want to hop out for this place?
push out. That was, that was the deepest part. Now this is just like a river, and at one point you look off to the right and it's just one big lagoon. Which we're just gonna float away and sink into wherever we're gonna go. Yeah. Is this where all the cars get swallowed? No, no, this is where he says, you know, stay to, stay to this side, because if you take a turn, it's just deep. Yeah, where the cars get swallowed. Yeah, I've walked it already, it's not that bad. I really need you to take your shoes off and walk down and get us going, if that's okay. There's nothing in there, don't stress out. It says to walk it, which means it's safe. I've just walked it, everyone else has walked it. Yeah? Or, you film me driving from here and then you follow behind. What do you mean, that's still walking it? Yeah, I know, but I would have then scared anything if that's what you're worried about. <sighs> yeah? I don't know. All right, come on. I come. How are you feeling? Really nervous, really nervous. Hey Zuri, we're gonna drive through the water. Do you wanna drive through the water? No, I wanna go in there, my no, mom. You don't wanna okay, go in how about we get to the other end and then you can go for a swim in a beautiful lagoon? No, I wanna come in here. Mom. No, there could be could be crocodiles in there. Oh, thanks. <laughs> no. Hey, no, no, please don't cry. This is very stressful for mummy and daddy as well. I'm shaking. It, it, this is no word of a lie, the most hectic shit that we have ever done. Not only are we one remote, two, water and electrics don't mix. And this is probably about a 50 meter stretch of water. You said um, 20. I did say 20, but it's around 50. And it just sort of goes up through the banks and like it is, yeah. Are you sure I can walk this? No I, I, just, I just walked it. I walked yeah, all the way to the end and back. I'm just nervous. You'll be fine. If you follow behind me, just follow behind me, you'll be fine. Okay. All right, guys, here we go. Can you wait for me? Can you make sure that you're I can't stop. You've just got to keep walking. I can't stop. I, I'm not going to be going fast, but you can, if you walk in the middle, it's high and it's firm. You can just keep going. It's fine. <laughs> this is killing us.
I'm so glad we, we took it on, hey. What, Zuzu? Daddy, daddy. Yeah. Want to have a fire? Yes, please. That's a fire day. Hey Zoo, can you help me? Can you help me set up the camp? Can I give you a job? Here you go. Pull this out. Hang on. Oh, a bit dusty. Can you take that over there, please? Over there. Over here. Over here. I'm gonna lay it down. Pretty cool, huh? I had too many things. I prayed that they were wrong. But I'm still happy now. Just think of what could be. If I was still around, the schedule was wrong. Is it yum? Hi. Are you eating your dinner? Yeah. Is it good? We're very relaxed, aren't we? Cool. This is the life. You'd want to be relaxed because tomorrow we have to get back down that track. Yay! But hopefully it's sort of like the other one. You know how like the way in takes ages and on the way out you're like, oh, that wasn't that bad. Mm. I have a feeling it's going to be kind of like that. Let's hope so. <laughs> anyway, I think we're gonna have an early bed tonight. Um, we just had a we had a little fire. Um, we might even go for a swim in the morning and get a move on. It was a place where all of the classical music trolls could live in perfect harmony. Yum yum yum. Come in, Lee. Okay. That's how we sleep every night. Siri just puts her feet up on you. So we're up early. Um, we're packing. We packed the combi up. It only took us probably about a good five, ten minutes. So the thing in our mind and all night, what I've been thinking is like, if we're the last people to leave and then we get stuck, we've got to wait for someone to come back the other way. That's if somebody comes back the other way. I think we're just lucky that there were a few people here yesterday because um, I was chatting to um, a group of people down the end and they said they've been here by themselves for three days. So yeah, we're prepared. I'm mentally prepared because it's all I dreamt about all day was... <laughs> We've done it. We know that we can do it. Yeah, we know that we can do it. Yeah. Um, but dead set, that's all I dreamt about all last night was river crossings <laughs> and the car lifting wheels and like getting launched and Ziri <laughs> screaming and I was just like, oh my god. Our first little water crossing. Two How to go. Feeling? They're not even water crossings, they're water like you... They're not a water crossing at all. What are they then? Well, crossing, I know, like you said, when someone says a water crossing, you think you're going across the river. Okay. When you got to think what this was like yesterday, you, you were, you were driving 
in a river. So you're going along it. You weren't crossing it at all. You're far okay. from crossing it. Fair enough. And that's what I was sort of like a bit, oh, here we are. Bloody hell, we're back at it again. <sighs> and so it begins. Take your time and off we go. <laughs> it's a very gloomy morning here this morning. It's like dark and windy. It's 6.30. Here we go. Oh, fuck. What do I feel like this? Did you just stop? Is this the wrong way? Why does that look different to what it did yesterday? Was there a dry patch there like that? I don't think there was. I reckon that's from the guys that went through this morning. No, 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 no. Yeah. Or was it always wet? Oh, no, isn't went... that the part, isn't that the part where the river, like there's a... Oh, there was a dry spot. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Because there was no other track in here, and there was it. This is it. Uh... No, this is it. Yeah, that's right. Oh, fuck! Hey. Oh. Nah, it's because we've hit a tree root. See, because I'm got power steering, if you're turning and your your wheel hits something on a bit of an angle, sure. it'll try and take the it'll try and turn it. That's why you went and turned real quick, and that's why I like I don't want it's kind of like holding onto a drill on low speed and then it gets hung up and it spins. It's just like that. It's and that's the that's the thing when you haven't got really hectic steering dampeners and stuff like that. And that's mm. what we haven't got. But all right, we're just about to tackle this bit here. This is the freaking River of Doom. <laughs> number one Woo! Um, that was I think that was only about 600 deep so the really long one near the campground is 600 deep at this very point in time um, remember we still got to go remember that spot where we knew it nearly flipped over mm, yes flipped I do over. remember start. will you find me hope you find me Was that, that was all the hard stuff done? Oh, that was, no, no. No, 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 the water, hard the, water, the water stuff the water, is done. The water's the stuff that, you know, you do relatively slow, but if you get water in the wrong spot, your car stops. And we could have stopped in the middle of the water, that's happened before. Yeah, and that's why momentum's <laughs> good, and if it's only a small bit of deep, at least you know you're gonna roll through it. Um, but now we've got to do, um, now it's just all the technical stuff, which yeah. is the- The sand, the rocks. The technical driving, the rocks, the slow going, the step ups. Um, we know what we're in for now, so it shouldn't be too bad. Shouldn't be too bad. <laughs> What's happened? All these vibrations. Yeah. 
it rattled. Um, like there's a pin that holds the oh, bottom of my mom, accelerator mom, pedal. Help, please. Not yet, Zuzu. We're going to go to the roadhouse. And it, it came out. So my, my, my pedal was just going. But all good now. Fixed. <laughs> Show, but we're up there. Let's just say the back tires are a meter above the front, and I'm probably nosing into the ground at the moment. Just like that. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Just get there. 